will be a go oriented in takeoff. However, in the event of a decision to stop before V1, I'll say stop in, close the thrust levers, disconnect the auto thrust, ensure maximum braking, manually raise the speed brake, and apply full reverse thrust. Your engine in operative game plan of runway 35. Okay, uh, below 80 knocks, are we going to board for any reason between 80 knocks and below V1? Only going to be for any fire, engine failure, aircraft unable to fly, or predict the wind shear. After that, we're going to continue at 400. We're going to assess the situation if we need to do any memory item. If not, we're going to continue. Uh, to climb to 2018 feet, which yep. is our engine out high seat. You let me know when I can start the engines. You can start with the number two. Gracias, señor. Start number two, please. Number two. Flaps one, please. Control check. And radar. Actually, the holy point hotel, the 135 is Charlie. Your thrust levers. My thrust lever. On runway 35. Heading checks, you have control. I have control, you have communication. Thank you. Set thrust. N1, heading select Toga, thrust set. V1, rotate. Positive clap. Gear up. Gear up. I'll nav. Check. V nav speed. Check. 1,000 feet to level off. Check. So we can reach 4120, report of friends, climb and maintain flight level 380, report reaching. Climb maintain level 380, report reaching, Dominican 4120. Gracias. 380. Yeah, nada, senor. 380 confirmed? 380 magenta confirmed. Okay, so we're going to be doing the VR Zulu runway 20 into uh, Guatemala. This VR has got a glide slope of 3 degrees, however the parpies are set to 3.5 degrees and it's got an upslope so we will appear to be, sorry, downslope so we will be, appear to be low on the approach path. From previous experience, the FMC database is loaded with the solid line which brings you into a point that's going to cross over the threshold too high. So from the final approach fix we follow the dotted line as far as we can if we're visual to get down to the runway. Twenty-five hundred. Ready on table. Check. One thousand. Wait. Approach table. Dominican four one two zero. Wind runway zero degrees one to nine. Runway two zero clear to land. Clear to land. Approaching minimums. Did you Minimums. I'm Set. sorry to go below the slope. Oh, don't worry. Um, do you see how broad it is to the right there as we cross that final point? 400. Okay, but two red, two white. Check. 300.
Okay, we're in Guatemala right now on a quick turnaround for Aerojet on the way back to Santo Domingo. And I'm going to show you the quick pre-flight. So as we're coming up, I'm looking at the temperature probe, the angle of attack vane and the pitot probe, making sure that they're clear and not blocked. I'm now checking the radome. No bird strikes. I can see the two pitot probes and the angle of attack probe on the, on the right side of the fuselage. I'm looking at all the hydraulic pipes and electrical connections. Static probes are open, no damage in the RVSM area. Looking at the back end of the engine, everything looks good. Leading edge of the wing, all the fuel uh, indicating system probes are in. The neck of valve is open, lights are on, condition of the wing tip, six uh, static wicks. All the filler devices at the flaps are in position. I've got the two brake pins, they are visible. Looking at the oleo, looking at any hydraulic leaks, condition of the tires, another two brake pins. Looking at the nitrogen system that it's on. The two uh, hydraulic accumulator tanks have got sufficient pressure. White powder hiding space. Leading edge of the horizontal stabilizer, three static wicks, pita tube on the vertical stabilizer, and the leading edge of the vertical stabilizer. Looking at the engine base to see that the engine panels are closed. Again, we're looking at the front end of the engine. Everything looks good, and everything's finished. That is a quick version of the pre flight V1. Rotate. Alpha Echo Romeo, repeat that. Wait to repeat for the now. Clear up, please. Alpha Romeo, recibió pista 2 Okay, perfecto. Notificó para cruces del Okay, perfecto. Notificó para cruces del Okay, perfecto. Notificó para cruces del Okay, perfecto. 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 Okay, Dominican 1, uh, 4, 1, 2, 1, uh, Las Americas approach, you are contact, continue sending to 1, 6, 000 feet and reduce the speed to 2, 5, 0, knots, number 3 in the sequence. No contacto de Torre América, en 1, 1, 8, decimal 1. Nice Buenas tardes. Right uh, uh, execute, please execute. Calmap. 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 This is beautiful. That's what I thought was going to happen. Yep. Standing by, cabin ready. Oh, you're done. Oh. 1,000 to go. That checks. North American power, continue approach, from the 17, wind 170 degrees, 10 knots, K&A, 29er, the 79er, 0. You said Alpha, you're down. You're down. Expect to start action in about one minute. Fifteen. Approaching minimums. Minimums. Going inside, landing, following the paths. Roger. Three hundred. Two hundred. One hundred. Fifty. Forty. Thirty. Twenty. Ten. Speed brake is up. No problem, señor. Traverse is normal. Check. United 1473 is ready for takeoff. United 1473 line up on wave, runway 17. Very clear for takeoff, 17, Tempo 1406. For me, it was a great pleasure to be part of this crew today, performing this fly, uh, demonstrating uh, the professionalism of that Arajet is keeping to the industry, accompanied with Captain Alan Brand. So thank you for being part of this project, uh, Just Plane, and thank you. I hope to see you again.
Everybody, welcome aboard Aerojet Service Flight uh, 2232. Shortly on our way to the beautiful island of San Martin. Today I'm flying with Conrado and uh, a bit of a complicated story today. He's going to be doing the takeoff here, I'm going to be doing the landing there and then we'll, we'll swap it around, but I'm sure you'll find out why later. Uh, flight time is nice and quick today. We expect a flying time of one hour and five minutes. It's a beautiful day out of Las Americas and uh, we're going to be flying towards the famous uh, Punta Cana. So hopefully we'll get a sight of uh, the uh, town there and then overhead Puerto Rico and then we'll set sail for the beautiful islands, Dutch island of St. Martin. So uh, we're ready to go. We just got our clearance. We're a little late, only three minutes. But uh, that's on time for island time. So uh, we're going to get start and push back clearance and uh, we'll be on our way shortly. Enjoy the flight with us. V1. Project. Project right. Gear up. Gear up. Hell no. Silver 0107 cross Lugo at maintained flight level 100. Right, folks, uh, welcome to flight level 350 in the cruise now. Uh, as you can see from uh, our little moving map display here, we're coming up uh, overhead Puerto Rico. And uh, not far to go until we're in St. Martin. Nice short flight, just to tell you what we did. Um, we started off in Las Americas, parked on the Charlie apron up here. Charlie 3, I think it was. Taxied out, uh, we can draw the lines here. We were supposed to depart off runway 35, and then uh, as we get pushed back, typically we get a, a runway change. So we taxied out to the north on Alpha, and we took off in a southerly direction. The SID is the Mela to Juliet, which had us getting airborne. We only went about three miles, started a left-hand turn, and then routed, let's get rid of that, done. Routed easterly towards Mela. Initial climb clearance was to uh, 15,000. Now en route, as you can see, uh, not far to go. We're passing the capital San Juan shortly, and then it's just islands the rest of the way. Um, this is St. Crocs, St. Thomas, this is St. Kitts, there's uh, Bird Island, uh, St. John's, lots of, lots of saints here. <laughs> what do we expect on arrival in uh, Princess Juliana is the RNAV approach for runway 10. There it is. Got some interesting names here. Our transition is usually, I, I say Gouda, but they say Gouda, yeah? So Gouda, Juice, some cool names. And the coolest one is if we have an engine failure and we route south, the, the holding position is called Mordor. So that's quite ominous. Anyway, straight in, not much to it. You can see on our map here, Gouda, straight in for the RNAV onto runway uh, 10. This is a non precision approach and it's got very high minimums. The missed approach point is at like 700 feet. So, um, as I mentioned earlier, this is a, a category C airfield for our company, which means only captain's landing, and that's one of the things we don't have a precision approach. And the second thing is we've got a, a mountain right in front of us. So on approach, you'll see that if we have to go around, it's an immediate right-hand turn, and we've got to make sure we get away from that mountain. Get down. Clear the land, Charlie Tango. Now we're going to the left. Back the uh, honor of approach on way one two. That is one six nine. Uh, right turn direct to you, man. Right turn approach uh, next flaps thirty. And for the uh, Martin two one one, from two climbing to climbing up to two thousand five hundred. Two hundred. Seven zero zero. Out of uh, one two three. Returning nine zero. Then bound then. It's crossing two one seven seven. Easy with seven zero zero. Clear back station. One hundred. Fifty. Forty. 30, 20, 10. Speed break up. 
That is approved, so it is time to maintain 5,000. Three that's normal. Roger, direct, uh, direct. 1,200 uh, meters five, remaining. Nine hundred remaining. I'm willing to take two zero and three miles the left base execute orbit. Sixty. Six hundred remaining. Dominica two two three two expedite back track gate taxi delta. Expedite and then uh we're gonna leave the wrong way via delta to hold. Okay, turning around and vacating via delta. Look now, but there's a twin hunter <laughs> playing chicken on runway two eight. Thanks. Anyway, the six three five eighteen forty five. Sir. Eighteen forty five. Eight gears available on the bus. We know how it works with these Dutch islands. They're going to give us the clearance on the tax. On the tax. Yeah. So we'll brief on what we anticipate and we'll adjust accordingly. If you're happy. Happy. All right, excellent. We parked in, uh, I think it's called Bravo 2. Bravo 2, that's correct. Okay. So we'll start with that. Taxi played Bravo 2, anticipate to push start, and we'll face our nose to the west. And then we're going to taxi out on taxiway Alpha for a full end departure on way 10. We check the plates on the way in. Kind of crosswind. Yeah, looks like it's working, eh? Uh -huh. Work in the bus. Dominican wing, 2233. Behind heavy airbus 330, landing at this time. Line up and wait. Behind landing back. Don't forget to wave, Conrado. There we go. Made somebody's day. <laughs> Taking pictures. On runway one zero. Runway right, one zero checks. V one. Rotate. Positive rate. Clear up. Clear right. Clear right. Turning right. Heading 180. 180. Set. Enough speed arm. Up. Set. So we're going to wait. Two, two, three, 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 on approach. We are contact. Clear direct. 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 One hundred. Fifty. Forty. Thirty. Twenty. Ten. Speed break up. Check. This is normal. Check. Folks, thanks for joining us on board this Aerojet service from Santo Domingo to St. Martin and back. It's uh, been an absolute pleasure having you on board. 
on behalf of uh, Conrado, myself, and the Aerojet team, we hope that uh, you guys enjoy this video as much as we've enjoyed uh, making it. A special thanks to Pierre and Just Planes for making this possible. And uh, we really look forward to seeing what you guys do with it. Vamos arriba. So, hello, my name is Albert. From We're flying today as Dominican 4450. I fly for Arajet from Santo Domingo to El Salvador with my colleague and captain, Jean Pierre. Hi, welcome. So, it's going to be uh, three hours, uh, roughly three hours and two minutes flight to Salvador. Initially 340 and final 380. It's going to be slightly bumpy, we had some weather out of Santo Domingo, then should be, after departure, should be nice and smooth all the way to San Salvador. Enjoy the flight. Uh, yes. Oh, Trust set, 80.8%. Checked. V1. Rotate. Positive rate, gear up. Hell yeah. That's up. Now we are on the way to El Salvador. That's where we are right now. We're just exiting Haitian airspace. Now my fellow captain is trying to reach Kingston controllers and that's going to be the route all the way to El Salvador as you can see we are expecting there is some thunderstorms nearby we have the volcano in Guatemala that's the first alternate for the arrival um, arrival wise I can talk through what we're expecting to do today will be from Atuma that's the airway that we're coming here. We're going to proceed all the way through the El Salvador VOR to complete the approach using the ILS DME X-ray for runway 07. So we're going to pass over the VOR, go outbound. Over the water, we'll turn to intercept the localizer 07. And approach arm. Tracker fire check. Flight 5, speed check. Salvador Tower, good morning, Dominican 4450. 2500. Dominican 4450, Salvador Tower, good morning, wind 130 degrees, 0 knots, GNH 287. Runway 07, clear to land, caution, caution per activity, around the runway. Okay. Down. Floor 15. I'm gonna give you speed here for speed check. Floor 15. Okay, clear to land and wind activity and the wind from the right. One, three, zero. Perfect. I'll put the logo and flat 30. Landing checklist. Land 30, 140, 141, 42, 42, check. Landing checklist, engine start which is continuous, speed brake, out of it. Landing gear, down, three green, down, flaps, 30 green lights. Landing checklist complete. Two. Have the field inside. Perfect. One thousand is stable. One thousand stable. Approaching minimums. Three hundred. 
minimums. Continue. 200. One hundred, fifty, forty, thirty, twenty, ten. Speed brakes up, checked. Reverser normal, checked. One thousand two hundred meters remaining. Sixty, you have controls? I got it. Control Terrestre, November 436, Wiki November, informando que hemos completado pruebas, gracias por su ayuda. Buen día. APO passes. So guys, as you see, we're already in the Salvador, San Salvador. Just, we have 40, about 40, 42 minutes to get ready for the turn back to Santo Domingo. Hope you enjoy. V1. Rotate. Positive right. Yeah, up. Coming up. L down. Open the light. Speed and speed. And I'm gonna go speed and intervention to 20 because it's gonna take us out. Perfect. You can take a look at Santo Domingo on the right side. 10,000. El nice over. El nice. Approaching minimums. Minimums. You got eight zero three left on Marika Tower. Four hundred. Three hundred. Two hundred. Nine knots headwind. From the right, just to the one hundred. Fifty. Forty. Thirty. Twenty. Ten. Okay. Thank you for your help. Okay. Reverse is normal. Allow it. Two, three, four, line up on way, runway, one, seven. I don't drink. Line up on way, runway, one, seven, all I do is two, three, four. All right, guys, so back to Santo Domingo. Hope you have enjoyed the journey today with us. Hope to see you soon. Ciao, ciao. Have a safe flight. Thank you.